Hi and welcome to part number 8 of building SAS using Django and Vue.js. In this part of the series I want to show messages to the user when they add new categories, delete them and so on. I will start by showing a message when a new category has been added. I open up the views.py inside the bookmark app. On the top here I want to import messages from Django from django.contrib import messages and then I'll scroll down to category add view and below here I say messages dot success because this is a success message I send a request and then I type the message. The category has been added and save. The messages are by default included in all templates, so we don't need to add it anywhere else in the code. But I need a little snippet inside the template to show it. When we add a category, we get redirected to the categories page. So that's the template I want to add it. So categories.html and on top here I want to check if messages exist. If messages, this will check if there is any messages in the system. Then I want to loop through all the messages for message in messages. And then I add a little bullmark code. Article class message is. And then I pass in the message tag, which will be success. Then class message body. And here I print the message like that. I can then go to the browser to test this. Categories, I've done something wrong here. Oh, sorry, it should be double curly and no. Try to add a category. Category test. And there you can see the message here. If I refresh now, it's gone. The messages is a part of Django's session system, so the message will be saved until you show it. Let me add this message to the edit category also. So then I can go back here and just copy this. The changes was saved. Perfect. I can also add this to the delete. And I paste it down here, category was deleted. Then I go here, delete category, category was deleted. Perfect. You can also add this to the bookmark add. The bookmark was added. Saved and also the delete the bookmark was deleted. Perfect. 
I also want to make some other changes to the forms because they really don't look good. Instead of letting Django generate them as paragraphs, I want to add the code myself. First I'm going to add a Bulma class to the fields. I do this by opening forms.py and down here I say def net self works k works super category form self dog because I need to run the parent save. self.fields title widget class it should be a list equals input I can copy this I think this is the correct way to do it text area and go to the browser and check it out if it's correct no text input has no attribute yes I forgot to add the S behind there as you can see it looks a little bit better now I want to do some more changes to the templates to separate this a little bit better so I go back here, I can remove the form as p div class, but I want to generate the title field label class label form dot title dot label tag Perfect, bold and looks a little bit better. Yeah, I can copy this form dot description. I can copy this, paste it around this class control. Now it looks much better. I need to repeat this for the add form. I can just copy the whole paste submit and save. The bookmark add is also quite similar. There's just one more field here I think it is. Yes you have the URL field as well. URL replace it with submit and then I copy it again for the no and save. I noticed that I have forgotten to edit a separate template for the bookmark edit. So I just want to replace this as a bookmark edit. Copy the contents of this file new file bookmark edit.html edit bookmark save changes perfect then I can check it out so edit okay I forgot to copy this replace with bookmark form URL save and refresh now it looks much better and that's it for this part of the tutorial in the next part I'm going to start by adding a little bit view.js
to subscribe to the channel and remember to click the bell to get notifications. If you like this video, please hit the like button below.